hi guys welcome back to my channel i'm so excited to come your way again with another video how are you all doing yes i'm so glad to be here to share with you guys the women africa Cup of nations qualifiers between super Falcons, nigerian national women team has was kept fired took place earlier this evening and the uh, I've come to give you the report of the match that was played, which Nigeria won by five goals to me. But before I do that, I'd like to say welcome to this channel. Thank you so much for your love and support. If you are here for the first time, I want to appreciate you greatly for the love and support you have shown. If you are here for the first time, please subscribe to the channel, press the notification bell so that you'll be notified each time I post new videos. And also help to share this video if it's possible for you to do. And to all my amazing subscribers, the new and the, and the returning one, thank you. I want to say, bravo, you've been so amazing. Thank you so very much. Please watch the video to the end. Give me a thumbs up and share this video as much as you can. If it is possible for you to do, I will so much appreciate it. All right, let's go into it. Nigeria. Nigeria 5, Cape Fed 0. Uchena Kanu and Esther Okoronko were at the braces as Nigeria secured a 3 4 5 0 win over Cape Fed in the final, in the first leg of their second round of the 2024 Women African Cup of Nations qualifier played at the Monshut at Biola Stadium in Abuja today. While Nigerian walked over Saltome, Principal in the first round, Kefed claimed an impressive C3, a great win over Liberia to set up the clash with the Falcons. But they were no match for the 90 African Queens in the Federal Capital Territory on Thursday afternoon earlier today. United States based Uchena Kanu scored twice and Gilt Monday added another in a frantic first half before Esther Okoronko came off the bench to grab to grab a brilliant double. Kano grew blood for the grew the first blood for the, for the Super Falcons when she found the net with an easy tap from the edge of the box in the seventh minute. Goalkeeper Chiamaka Nadusi made a stunning save to deny Cape Fred from equalizing shortly afterward. It was the wake up call for Nigeria that that was what Nigeria needed as Tenerife forward Monday double the lead for the, the Falcons following Goma Strambul in the 25th minute. Pete, it is uh, midfielder. Pete midfielder Deborah Abiodun was running rings. Around the Cape Fed Fedians in the midfield. Still, it was Atletico Madrid midfielder Rashid Ajibadi who came close to making it three in the 33 minutes, but her fine effort flew narrowly wide. Nigeria would not be denied, though, as Wikin Akanu scored the third with a second of the match of Tony Payne's brilliant pass just before half time. Esther Okoronko replaced club, club teammate Monday gift in the 53rd minute and shortly after the hour mark, the substitute increased Nigerian lead to four with a sublime finish of Akudo Obona's cross. 11 minutes later, Esther Okoronko grabbed a second of the match as she pounced on Rufia to Moran's cross to make it five for the home side. The game eventually ended 5-0, with Nigeria recording their biggest win in a competitive fixture since beating Equatoria gaining 6-0 at the Cup African, I mean, Convention of African Football Women African Cup of Nations in 2018. Cape Fade and Nigeria will meet again for the second leg on December 5 at the Estadio 
national do ka kabo fired in pride we are nigerian we look to maintain the advantage so it was an easy win for nigeria as they defeated the cafe cafe by five goes to me it was a brilliant performance and then uh, they should build upon that the second leg that is coming up on the 5th of december well even though super falcons means some of their star players like oshuala like ashley Plumtrail. And a host of others, yet they were still able to produce a good performance to give Nigeria a, a very big cushion as they go in into the second uh, leg of the match coming up in a couple of days. Guys, that is the report of the match between Nigeria and Cape Verde as Nigeria wall up them by five goals. To me, I would like to have your opinion. What is your thought about the match? What is what do you have to say about it? I like your comments, please, on the comment section for people to watch and see what your opinions are. One more time, I want to sincerely appreciate each and every one of you, especially if you are here and you have not subscribed to the channel, please. <laughs> Subscribe to the channel and press the notification bell so that you'll be notified each time I post videos. And to all of you that have been of tremendous support, I want to say continue to support, continue to be our wonderful friends on this channel. Thank you so very much. Guys, what is left for me to say is to encourage each and every one of you that if you can dream it, you can achieve it. It's not your absolutely that's not achievable if your mind is set on it. Others have been there. Yours cannot be an exception. If they were able to make it, you will make it. Don't relegate yourself. Don't look down on yourself. Believe in what you can do. And uh, you will get there. It's a matter of time. Will I come your way next time? I say to you, bye, bye.